the slope of the Silwan Valley outside of the old city of East Jerusalem, a drab and nondescript concrete bunker hides a hidden world underneath. Buried in this hill, Israeli archaeologists have uncovered what they say is an important archaeological find. Gigantic cut stones that form part of a massive and ancient wall, the largest such construction ever unearthed around the city of Jerusalem. All this area is new and now you can see if we look from here up, you can see how all that wall go up. Right. And you see all the big boulders. Each boulder is five, four ton each. Archaeologist Ali Shukran has been digging in this location since 1995, but it is only in the last year that this section of wall was uncovered. This is the first time in archaeologists of Israel that we see a wall that built before 3,700 years that stood like that. Look, it's more than eight meters. The wall is believed to have been meter. built by the Canaanites, an ancient if pagan people who the Bible says stone. inhabited Jerusalem and other parts of the Middle East before enough. the advent of monotheism. And, and, and Excavation director Ronnie Reich says the complexity of the construction reveals new detail about the sophistication of Middle Bronze Age Jerusalem. To build straight walls um, up eight meters, to put the stones on the seventh meter above is uh, not, I don't know how to do it today without mechanical equipment. I don't think that any engineer today without uh, electrical power will not be able to do it. So according to archaeologists, all of these elaborate and ancient fortifications were put in place to protect this a natural spring that provided water to the people of Jerusalem. Water that still flows today and is used by the present-day inhabitants of this ancient city. We can see here. Back inside the excavation, Eli Shukran tells us this section of wall could be the tip of the iceberg and pledges to keep working. I'm going to dig down, I'm to, going to dig up, and then to understand, to see what, what, what I can, what I can uh, get. Uh, from the site. Until that time, the site has been temporarily open to the public. Kevin Flower, CNN, Jerusalem.